as a kid, I went through a lot. Uh, before the age of six, um, I lost most of my immediate family. Uh, my mother, my grandmother, and this is where I'm still in DC. I was born in DC. Uh, I was raised in Memphis. My mother, um, my mother did her things and where often she would leave the house and uh, my grandmother's old and sick. Now my grandmother, God rest her soul, both both these women, God rest their souls. But my grandmother's my biggest inspiration. She's an actress as well. I'm a, I'm a second generation actor. I, I'm pretty much third. Um, she's an Emmy award winning actress. Um, if you get what I'm saying, if you put two and two together, it's in my genes. Um, and with the God-given talent I have of acting, and not only acting, uh, the essence of charm and the essence of charisma and the essence of knowing that everything happens for a reason and we have to just go with the flow and flow like water, as Bruce would say. And we take the good with the bad and we realize that we're essentially blessed in the all, all in the same time. Um, my grandmother died in 02. My mother died in 04. I've got six other siblings that I that I know and I've met, of course, and we've all been under the same roof, that's fine. Um, it's not like we were split up, don't think that. Um, but the ones, the siblings I hold most and dear to my heart are my, my, my twin brother and sister. Well, they're not, I, we're not twins. They're twins, but they're nine years older than me. Um, while my mother was out and my grandmother was sick, they were the ones that took care of me. Um, and I'd do anything to get them, uh, to give back to them and not only them and their children and their children and of course my children so that uh, we can all be that one family again. Um, I feel that's my destiny, really, uh, is to bring our whole circle just back together again. Uh, sorry. I apologize. It's been a minute since I've touched this subject. But yes, through all that, <laughs> through the blessings that I've see, received from that experience. Uh, I would consider myself outgoing. I have no other choice but to be. I can say, yeah, the, the, the world sucks and, 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 and I can say that nothing's fair in life and, and, and nothing's fair at all and nothing is guaranteed. But I can also say there's a God that loves us so and will do whatever he has to do to make sure that we succeed and that we're blessed and we're protected and we're safe. I have no choice but to be outgoing and to share that, to share that with everybody that I meet and to have some peace, not only humbleness, but happiness and acceptance in life is what it is and we do the best we can to to better it for ourselves that's the thing um, you give me anything to do I'll do it ten times old um, and with the love and care of doing it and not just to make money but to make happiness um, and to create great experiences and memories with people to where you can sit back at the end of your life and say, I'm glad I did this, or I've done that, or I've met this person, or I've met that person. Um, but that is sacrifice wish for me. Um, yeah, that's me. So it's a two part video. <laughs> um, so I hate to take up all this time, but that is exactly page fresh for you. Thank you for the opportunity.